morning videos. Happy Sunday afternoon. Uh, we're gonna take a quick pause to our usual YouTube shenanigans. Our shenanigans. Uh, we're gonna do a quick little video. Um, it's been a top question for a long, long time. Everybody Facts, seems to want. Nosy. Everybody seems to want to know how did y'all meet? How did this come to be? <laughs> All right. Well, I'm gonna tell you a little story. He's gonna say his side, and then I'm gonna say the real story. All right, so this is how it happened, all right? And all it's right, going to be boom. short and quick, right? Bam. So it's a Youth Try Monthly, August of 2016, all right? Um, the assistant rep of the Bronx at the time. And um, I'm doing my thing. I'm greeting people. Then one, uh, one uh, um, a guy that he used to go to our church, right? And now he goes to Los Ciento y Vente, right? Um, he bumps into me. We hadn't seen each other in a long time. He's like, yo, okay, I'm like, yo, God bless, Ray. What's going on? How you doing? Long story short, he's like, I want you to meet somebody. Um, uh, it's, um, and I go, okay. Then uh, two seconds later, she walks in and he's like, oh, this is my daughter. And I go, oh, I, yeah, wait a minute. When, when did you have a daughter? I thought you only had two boys, right? And I'm like, wow, this girl is really pretty. Like, okay. Right. And, but then immediately what came to my mind was, Gavon, you're here to minister. Bring it back. Right, so I had to ignore, you know, the thoughts of wow, this girl is so pretty, and you know, let me, let me bring it back, right? So, a few months pass, right? Oh, uh, one month pass. Now, this is where we actually interact. So the first time, in the tri monthly, it was just like a hey, nice to meet you. Mm -hmm. In my mind, I'm like wow, anyway. she's pretty, and then we kept it pushing, right? The next month we have this event, right? It's a movie night, and um. She's there again. She actually walks in with someone, right? <laughs> uh, and I'm like, oh, okay, no. okay, no problem. Oh, she, she's talking to somebody. That's cool as I, I bet, <laughs> right? Oh, that's funny. Um, and then I ended I'm going to explain that later. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's not what it look, sounds like. So I ended up needing some help, right? So I was like, hmm, let me see if I could get that girl to help me real quick. Oh, excuse me, how you doing? Could you, I need some help. Could you help me? Right? She says yes. Right? Right? So then, uh, you know, the whole night, uh, she's she's insulting my choice of candies. And uh, Keeping it real. She's like, chocolate? Who eats chocolate? I found out later she doesn't like chocolate. That's why she was doing that. But she's like, chocolate? Uh, you need sour Skittles. You need Sour Patch Kids. That's what you eat at a movie. I was like, damn, all right. My fault. Right? Um, then... Fast forward again, one month later, it's October, and she, uh, and, uh, we were gonna have a coffee house. No, it's November. No, no, this is October, right? Mm -hmm. we, we're gonna, October. She's gonna have a coffee, we're gonna have a coffee house, right? And they're like, oh, we need to get in contact with 120, whatever. Mm. I'll volunteer. Listen, uh, let me. No problem. Uh, I don't have a problem. You know, I could, I could get in contact with. Her. That's not a problem. Um, I like I like Ray for her numbers. It's, it's all good, right? So that's how I got the number, right? Uh, so I literally just texted her straight, pure, professional. Hey, God bless you. I'm Kayvon. No, you, know. you called me. I called you. Yes, and I was like, who? How did you get my number? Oh, so so I called her professionally. Hey, how you doing? God bless you. This is Kev. I'm the assistant rep. You know, I'm getting in contact with you. You know, uh, Ray gave me your number. It's just because we want your church to get involved. So we would like for you guys to participate in the coffee house now in October. And I was like, okay, hold on. Why are you giving strangers my number? I told Ray. <laughs> Why are you giving people my number? All right. Okay. Yeah. Continue. So, um, so boom, right? That's that's where I got the number. Um, then, uh, you know, my sister, right? She saw one day. I think. Oh no! One day I was with my sister, right, driving in my in the car, and um, Destiny calls me, and she's like, she goes, she picks up. I pick up. I'm like, oh, hello, how you doing? She's like, um, hey, hey how you know what what what's up? What you up to? And I was like, oh, nothing. I'm on my way to rehearsal or whatever. She was like, oh, uh, okay, well, well, bye. When she hung up, my sister goes, bro, she likes you. She like, I'm like, no, 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 she doesn't. No, no, she, she doesn't like me now. She's chilling. She's doing her own thing right now. And I'm doing my own thing. No, no, no. She, you know, it's all good. It's all cool. No, she don't like me. My sister's like, oh, she like you, right? So, Why don't we? So, so then, right, um, 
fast forward now to November, right? It's uh, gospel night and um, gospel night. Then, um, you know, that's uh, so gospel night, right? Um, the week, at the, the Monday after gospel night, right? Um, that we actually like um, hung out. I guess because we got you know we got some coffee, some donuts for for fire team. We were on our way to a meeting. Yeah, it was on a fire team meeting. So we go. I took her. You know, boom, come back. Nothing. About two, three weeks later, it was like she's like, so wait, so what are we doing here? And I was like, um, what do you, what do you mean? She's like, yeah, what are we doing here? Um, because you know I'm not trying to waste my time. Listen, you trying to talk to me or not? You know, and I was like, all right, bet. And then she was like, but we not, but listen, we just talking. We're not doing no boyfriend, girlfriend stuff. We're not holding hands. We're not doing none of that, okay? And I was I was like, all right, cool, no problem. I respect Don't it. Don't claim me on your income tax. And yeah, that's, that's how then, you know, we came to be, I think. Seems pretty accurate. Thank you. You know, I try so, my best. Basically, to, to you know... The moral of the story is, you know, we kept bumping into each other at church-related events, sectional events. Um, And I think for me, the real thing was, like, I wasn't going to any of these events in my head. Like, okay, I'm going to go find me a boyfriend or, like, I'm going to this event to to find me somebody to talk to. And that wasn't your mindset either. Mm -hmm. You know, it was just two people who, you know, are doing our thing separately, working in the section. And, um... God allows everything to happen for a reason, so um, it is and what it is. That, ladies and gentlemen, is how we met. That's now, how we met. And now we have how many kids is it now? <laughs> we have like four wonderful kids that we've adopted. Yeah, to one our, of them is hiding in the background. Right our now. little ministry of. Our little chickadees. You can. Yeah. St- we love each and every one of them. The but same. It's been fun. We're now we're about to make two years together. Mm-hmm. Um. So yeah, you know, I encourage you guys to go to the chat monthlies. <laughs> go to the chat monthlies. You might never know. You never know who you're gonna meet. Also, listen, man. Just do your thing. As long as... See, she was doing her thing for the Lord. I was doing my thing for the Lord. You know, I had my relationship with God. She exactly. had her relationship with God. And then, bam, he blessed us with the person that's meant to be for us. Mm-hmm. You know? That's really key. Because so I wasn't your thing. trying your to impress thing. you with, you know, let me... Oh, let me get involved now. Or let me, you know, be spiritual now because I'm trying to impress this guy. Mm-hmm. Um, God is... I don't think God is ever going to bless you authentically that way because he knows your intentions and he knows your heart you know and like yeah like you know don't try to use god right as a as a as a matchmaker like, right don't do that you know don't pray because now you want a boyfriend now you want a girlfriend no oh, father god please I'll or only pray president. because you want no. god to confirm no. oh this is the person for me so you're fasting for a whole week now but you've never fasted for anything else like you know that yeah. doesn't please god that's lame that's and right. that's not how it works Pray on your own. Get a relationship with God because you want a relationship with God. And then it'll, everything it'll else, come, man. Listen, everything else let me, will come. Let me check before I actually start preaching because there's a Bible verse that's, that talks Seek about Seek first that. the kingdom of God okay. and all these things shall be added on to you. Yeah, you missed one part, but it's all right. <laughs> what did I miss? Uh, Seek first the kingdom of God and all his righteousness. Oh, sorry. That's important. Yeah, his righteousness. All his righteousness. Separation. Okay. Wait, can you cut something out real quick? Like, I wanted to say something. What do you want to say? Uh, like, like, cause like the coffee, uh, right? Cause the coffee house. No way! Stop. Oh, <laughs> That's our son. He's wait, wait, wait. All right, bye, guys. Now wait.